Hello YouTube, my name is Jacob Linkus with Linkus to Bushcraft. Today I want to talk to you guys about Pathfinder Knife Shop Kephart XL. And you can get these knives on the selfalliance.outfitters.com at their store. But um, this is 10 inches overall, 5.5 inches on the blade and 4.5 on the handle. It's 1095 high carbon steel. They do not come with sheaths, so you have to purchase them separately. And the sheaths, I believe, are $29. So, and this, when I actually bought it back in December, was $135. And now they dropped their price significantly down to, I think this now is $109. Or it might actually only be $100. So they dropped the prices on these quite a bit. Um, this kept hard. I'm not a huge fan of the handle actually shave mine down quite a bit because when they come in they're kind of blocky but also I sanded this down quite a bit too but this stuck out real far and I know they're going for the traditional cap heart which I get but um to me the handle almost feels a little small to, for the blade and I feel like the blade is actually up too far see now look at this cap part L to your right. Now look at the difference. If you can see that. You see how further up the PKS cutting edge is compared to the L to your right? Pretty significant. So I'm not a fan of that. But overall, I mean, this is a good knife. I mean, if you're into the big cap heart, and also, I didn't even think about that. I wonder if that's for... Huh. You can use that for your ferro rod. I don't know if that's what that's there for, but... Might be. But, this is a good knife. And like I said, if you're into cap hearts, this is, they do go for the more traditional. But I do love the Pathfinder knife store. I love, 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 love their knives. I like getting the knife kits and I make quite a few of them. I've made now four, but I uh, also have the Scorpion HD, as you can see. These two are the exact same size, but still, I do like this quite a bit. This thing is a phenomenal bush knife. A camp knife, woods knife, whatever you want to call it. This thing will work wood like nobody's business. That sounded really inappropriate. <laughs> Like I always say, get some of the curls for the girls. Yeah, you can see, like, you gotta get, like, you're trying to do that fine work. I feel like it, you almost have to reach out too much to do it. Like I said, th this is my opinion, too. I mean, this doesn't. Some people might like that, I don't know. But see, I feel like my hand, like this right here, I'm trying to do fine work. I should be back here a little bit more. This thing does cut really good though. I 
That makes feather sticking easy. I mean, overall, I mean, their, their workmanship is great. So, I mean, I'm not trying to knock them at all. It's just this knife is not for me. But, uh... Make a notch. I will say this much though. As far as a camp knife, I mean, you really can't go wrong with this though. Notching super easy. And just like any of the other knives you're going to get from them, they're going to come with a very sharp spine. They got 90 degree spines on all their knives. So if you don't actually have something to strike your ferro rod, you can always use your knife. Like any of the other knives, I mean, you're, they're gonna shower. There it goes. Well guys, That is my take on the PKS Kephart XL. Uh, if you guys like the videos, hit the like button. Uh, if you want to talk to me about the videos, that'd be great. I'd love it. Um, if you like to subscribe, that would be great. And oh God. But. As of now, I have one subscriber. Well, actually it says two, but the other one's my girlfriend, so it doesn't really count. But anyways, hit the subscribe button if you'd like to subscribe, hit the like button, or the dislike, whatever which one you want to do. That's fine, free world, free country. But you guys have a good day. Thank you.